good morning good afternoon good evening welcome to prince amnila entertainment tv subscribe to the channel follow us on all our social media platforms instagram and facebook it's a prince mill entertainment prince mill entertainment we are now available on our facebook group which is uh prince miller entertainment tv and uh, we have facebook group who enjoy the family and also whatsapp group uh, once you join our facebook group there's a link there which is our whatsapp group and you are able to, to actually uh, join and uh, and uh, welcome to another edition of uh, audio thoughts uh, with prince today is the 2nd of april 2021 happy easter to everybody and i'm gonna say you know uh, wherever you are wa listening and watching us from and uh, so uh today i just woke up i'm still in bed by the way i did that i was just like checking on my facebook then i saw this whole story uh you know which is uh, trending on twitter actually on twitter and uh, hashtag uh, retrench peter ndoro and uh, which is trending on social media on twitter also on facebook most africans are good uh, first i know the peter ndoro uh, i know the part about sbc one if you are here in south africa you know what i'm talking about the main are wearing a news by SABC one and the man he mostly covers near with Zimbabwe like what is happening in Zimbabwe and he is a, a presenter and he is not only a, the man needs to go he needs to go because he is only good because SABC could go to train for one and he got 600 plus one of the train to our Russia bus for you come on a lot of track that could not maximize around the normal advice what so People as uh, Peter Ndoro is one of those people that needs to lose their jobs because he's a foreigner. He's a foreigner. Boss, we wanna pay the treatment you're gonna take with Tika company. In most cases, when we wanna South African, then we're allowed to put a you know, when we're doing foreigner, we will be among those people who are losing their jobs because a uh, company cannot retrain a South African. Uh, it's just same Zimbabwe. Eh, uh, but you need to say people. So hope you you know uh, did. Uh, do some post of course you know the men to talk about this he says that idiots are pushing the hashtag retreat peter Ndoro hashtag in south africa show their foolishness uh when they want a black african with their legal documents out but they have a chinese representing them in parliament when stupid when a stupidity arrives it doesn't make an official announcement what a bunch of idiots and they have to put a you know a picture of a chinese uh woman and uh, I have Feka ANC and Galia and also Peter Ndoro at the bottom. So Opo is on the side of uh, Peter Ndoro is saying that uh, Peter Ndoro and my documents are going to be as one of the men has been reading news with SABC for a long time and uh, so he doesn't deserve to be kicked out. And uh, can you can you push it like you, you don't go worry, you see that uh, that necessary and uh, of course you have to be retrained so as you end the good room for in the area now to room south african kind of portion actually you know you could change what you need to be retrained they cannot choose a you know good put on the to go to change your mass stuff again change your mass bubble and change but of course then one of my positions our you know but our our group this our group this up a company who was our advice that you know that important static static in the so they are being removed from sbc so uh rutendo based on matanyarare and the other man is also outspoken he's hope a 2.0 he effect is uh hope before hope and it the man has been the guy i do follow on social media and the anti rose and the one he actually wrote a, a a statement here saying that uh peter ndoro made a career of bad mouthing zimbabwe apparently south africans are tired of peter ndoro on sbc and they want him to go back home it happens that peter spent his whole career it's a sadic pushing disinformation against zimbabwe lying that us and eu sanctions on zimbabwe were targeted on politicians and claiming that zimbabwe violates human rights even though there is no single judgment or investigation against Zimbabwe for human rights violations by any international court or mandate or body, example Human Rights uh, UN Human Rights Council. This is what uh, you know, uh, Rutendo uh, Benson Matinyarari, you know, have commented, you know, on his Facebook uh, group. I should say, you know, you know what. Uh, Peter Ndoro is showing how he passed. The man has been bad mouthing uh, Zimbabwe for such a long time. I mean, guys, come on, guys. Muno, I'm not sure about SBC. BC, uh, you know, 
there are people who give them news. You are now represent SABC, ZBC. The guy is a presenter, he's a messenger actually, he's a messenger. The man just read news. And the news, he doesn't create news, he reads news. Of course, the narrative is ABC in a about this situation and Chakajere Kutukungo Tara this situation. So it happened that the man is from Zimbabwe. So I don't think it, the man Anto Mukamakusen also did not uh, today I want to go and bash Zimbabwe or today I want to go and bash this. And, and they are. so Hope I uh, did actually reply to that uh, post here, Tendo Benson uh, Mati Nyarare. He wrote, uh, Where uh, are the uh, South Africans who are xenophobic towards foreigners? let us not forget the self-hate in our community some of, of the bio uh, against peter andoro is coming from zanu pf clowns like benson who hate uh, peter's el eloquent uh, reporting against zanu pf's uh, corrupt rule beware of such defenders of the regime who are hiding behind uh, this idiotic campaign cool south africans and zimbabweans must stand with peter because he's in south africa illegally and is employed on the basis of his qualifications it's a shame that Zanu PF uh, chatelains are like Benson have so much hurt in themselves such that they would want to see another Zimbabwean harmed for simply telling the truth, reject their nonsense. And uh, this is what Opio uh, is replying to uh, Tendo Benson. So I think yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't go pair the whole day to day or, or some few days to come, uh, the war between uh, Opio and uh, Rutendo and of course Rutendo Futa and Nete Kupindura Futa we're gonna see a battle here against this whole issue yeah Pitandoro hashtag uh, retrench Pitandoro so guys I wanna say Hope has been the guy who has been given a platform by SABC the man has been interviewed in and out by SABC for a long time so I'm not surprised that Arugutsigira you know Pitandoro to be Kutarambi at SABC one. In this manner, I'm on my own views as well. No good, this is all the thoughts of the prince. In most of the language, I just feel good. Uh, Peter Noroga is a guy who got a guy who is just a presenter. In the modern language, he's just a presenter. It happens to be that he's from Zimbabwe. As for retrenchment, you can SABC now retrench uh, Peter Noroga and go on retrench. Without going out into Zimbabwe, you can do Botswana. You can position your guy, you present. You can walk around. Maybe I'll be zangwe two. You can be zangwe one. It, it, it happens to him to be, you know, one of the people who gonna be retrenched. Eh, of course, you can go this way. So I still feel good. You know, it's up to SABC. Panya yet to retrenchment. Yeah, okay. So you go to Zimbabwe. You can move Botswana. You can go to Zambia. I just being xenophobic. Let the men work. Let the men work. The men has been on SABC for a long time. Just like any other presenters who are also being retrenched. So I'm going to start a in Zimbabwe. I'm going to say, I'm going to say, I'm going as a presenter. I'm going to say, as a presenter. For him to read news, I don't think we can investigate anything. The men, I'm going to go to the studio. I'm going to say, I'm going to say, I'm going to say, I'm going to say, is the nine is very young. He, when I was talking very young, he anti rose and anger she's zero because the men grew up in Zimbabwe. He, he, he actually grew up in Zimbabwe. So I still feel good to any experience about our country. He knows uh Zimbabwe. I mean I say so. I don't got to rose and anger she's zero. I don't have much Zimbabwe. And I don't got to tell you. So I don't got to who's going to have much. I don't know what you to bag it to good dura or for good dura and all that saga. An experience about Zimbabwe. So many people they don't want that. They don't want to hear the other side of uh, of the things. They just want a positive side or a negative side about Zimbabwe. So I should think with uh, Adam Botaro is really boring if you took home Zimbabwe and all that saga. It's one of those situations that so many people feel threatened when whenever he present in other Zimbabwe because the thing with the man is just bad mouthing Zimbabwe, but the man is actually saying. The experience that people are facing in Zimbabwe. That's why ZANPF is pushing for that uh, patriotic beware. You know, you need to be patriotic. You know, uh, arrest uh, those Zimbabweans. You know, it is what it is. So, guys, let's talk in the comment section. I'm going to say, do you agree with what uh, Rutendo Benson Mata Nyarari is saying, or do you agree what Hope is saying regarding to Nyaya Pitandoro? Uh, based on my points, based on my points, I now and it. And uh, do you think Peter Ndoro 
should be retrenched in the SABC because of him bad mouthing Zimbabwe. Can I tell you that the people in the SABC because the man has been reporting news. More, more reporter. You know, I only I just see him as a reporter, as a guy who's been a presenter by SABC. I don't know any old news. I don't know any old news. Just like a guy Oscar Pambuka Pangaru who said this. I don't go poor news. I don't go to the news. I don't go to the news. I don't go to the news. So you know what I'm talking about? The news people. I don't go to the news. I don't go to the news. I don't go to the news. So if they want to blame uh, him, bad mouthing Zimbabwe, uh, Zimbabwe, they should blame SABC. Because in the narrative, you actually you are not push you. And SABC do one way. One way, 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 one uh, thank you very much for listening and watching. This is our audio thoughts with Prince on Prince Miller Entertainment TV. Subscribe to the channel and remember to follow us on all our social media platforms, Instagram and Facebook. Happy Easter and guys, be safe and be safe. Thank you very much for listening and watching. Peace out.